No. Well, birthday, it's a celebration. Yeah. Are you ready? Hop up. Uh, hey. <laughs> every second, every minute, man, I swear that she can get it. Say if you a bad bitch, put your hands up high. Hi, everybody. It's your girl, Risa Flirt, and today I'm coming to you with another video. But this video is super special because my sister is here. Oh! <laughs> my hey. sister is here. Hey, Reese's followers. <laughs> I call them subbies. Oh, hey, subbies. Well, subbies or subbies. Hey, Fleur subbies. Yeah, Fleur subbies. Okay, Fleur subs. <laughs> Flurbies. No. 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 The Flurbies? <laughs> no. Okay, this is. What do you want to call yourself? Nick? Okay. I call her Nick, so she's going to just go by Nick. You don't want to say your full name? I don't know. It's already been mm -hmm. Nick. Okay, so it's Nick. And we're going to do a sister tag, so we're going to ask questions about each other, or questions about, e yeah, questions about us to each other. Right. 55 questions, we're not doing all of these. So there's a total of 55 questions, we're not doing all of them. <laughs> so, yeah. Okay, so I'll, you want me to do the first one? What was their price? I'll do the first one. So the first question is, what was their most prized childhood possession? And I would say um, it would probably be a, a stuffed animal that my grandmother gave her named Violet. That's a good one. Um, <laughs> do I have to answer the same one for you? I know. She's picking you another question. The next one? Okay. What, um, okay, so second question. What did they do that was a little kid that was super embarrassing? Nothing. <laughs> I was perfect. <laughs> That's that would have Vaseline. <laughs> was that embarrassing to you? No. I did several things with Vaseline. <laughs> I remember I <laughs> <laughs> Yeah, I <laughs> <laughs> it was literally shit. shit. <laughs> that wasn't embarrassing to you though, because she was bad. She was bad. She did that as a dare. Or what about the time when we were trying to get you, when we talked you into letting us like slam the door to get your tooth out? You remember that? Yeah. But that wasn't embarrassing. I don't think we're not really embarrassed. People like we have fun. Like we don't really. No. no. Okay. So. What sports did I play growing up? She didn't play a sport. Yes, we did play sport. What? Shout out to CPE2. Uh, we played kickball. Booty tag, bitch? Oh. Kickball. Everybody <laughs> was going to say booty tag. <laughs> we played kickball. Oh, is double dutch a sport? Yes, I, I would think so. I jumped double dutch. Double dutch. And kickball. And kickball. You want to do this one? Um. What did they want to be when they grew up? I think, I think you always wanted to do something with PR. I feel like for a long bit of my life, but I honestly couldn't even remember what I wanted to be as a kid. I remember you wanted to be a doctor. Yes, I still call you Dr. Dr. Edie. Edie. Yes, check it in. So, that didn't kind of <laughs> sort of happen, but you work, she works for a hospital, so she's close. No, I don't want to work in the medical field. Yes, you do. Don't you want to be a counselor? That's technically a medical field. I changed my mind. All right, we're going to have this conversation. <laughs> <laughs> okay. I, I, my job has uh, given me enough experience to know that that's not something I want to do. Okay. Mm. What kind of treats do they always want on their birthday? Oh my God, everything. This girl is like the type of bitch, like she knows when the new candy drops. <laughs> I remember one time, like we was older, she got the package of the red velvet Oreos. I'm like, how did you get the express package? She's like, yeah, they sent me to try. <laughs> like, what? <laughs> so, any snack. She's with it, but she, she really likes um cake. Yes, I do. So, I, I don't really think it's a special, but she really is a good baker, so it makes sense that she likes sweets because she's good at baking. Um, okay, the next one is, what was their favorite book as a kid? I think we had the same favorite book. Yours. The print, 
Girl, you know I don't know the name of that goddamn book. The Princess Nafari and the Sister. Oh my god, yes! Um, Mafaro's Beautiful, Beautiful Daughter. I used to love oh, that I book. I used to love that book too. Yeah, see? Oh my gosh, I love that book. Okay. Okay, the next... Um, what do you do that still drives... What do you do that still drives them totally crazy? My sister, what she does that drives me totally crazy, she does... The same thing that my mom does, which is this annoying <laughs> thing with their throat. It's like, please stop it. Oh my god, that's so annoying. Um, one thing that my do my sister does is totally nothing know. again. No, I'm also real. Like I'm gonna go with probably nothing. No, I'm not letting you slide. Nothing. Next question. Yeah, she doesn't really. No, you know what she used to do? Like when we used to live together, she would like wear my clothes. <laughs> that used to irritate me. Yes, but, I would. But now because, it doesn't. Like some of her dresses, I think that they would look better on me. <laughs> Pipe down. Yes, because I was given body. Pipe down. Sis. I was given body. Pipe down. Sis. <laughs> okay. Um. What is something that completely changed about them as they got older? Nothing. We the same. We, we stay really ten are toes. The same. Um, I look. I can't even say. We stay ten toes down. What the? F what does that mean? <laughs> I don't know. I just thought it was cool to say. Okay. <laughs> um. Okay. The next one is. What is something that? Sh oh wait. No. <laughs> Let me see what the next question oh, no, is. Right. Where else did they apply to college? Risa applied to all the HBCUs. <laughs> and she went to a HBCU. <laughs> I applied to white schools. I applied to Syracuse and I got in, remember? Oh, yes. I applied, but that was the only school. Who, oh, this is a good question. Okay. Who was the person they thought they were going to end up with in high school? <laughs> is that like For me or for you? They both in jail? Oh no, they don't. <laughs> Damn! <laughs> okay. No, 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 no. Okay, <laughs> hers is in jail right now. And are you, I actually. Who? Out of jail. I used to, I used to love him. I really genuinely liked him. You know that. Who you thought I would be with? Girl, no. Oh, girl, oh, boom, no. I broke up with that when I was going to college, honey. <laughs> I got sick <to> of. <laughs> uh, anyways. Uh, okay. What's the best, best, what? Well, the best place they ever traveled? I'm not gonna say this is the best place she ever been, but for her 25th birthday, me and my mother surprised her with a trip to Puerto oh, all expense to pay trip to Puerto Rico. If yeah. that's not her favorite trip, then. <laughs> That was a great trip. Um, yeah, that was a great trip. The best place that my sister has probably ever traveled. Hmm. I want to say like one of the islands, like Jamaica. But I don't know what type of memories that those hold for her. Because she was like with her ex. So, yeah. You just be telling all my damn business. These people gonna know me more than anything from that, you. They supposed to know you. This is these are supposed to be your 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 social family. Hi, social family butterflies. Right. What's oh no, we just read that. What outfit did they wear all the time as a kid that your parents still talk about? That doesn't no. <laughs> no. Skip. We don't, we're not white. What's their favorite season? Her favorite season is summer because she was born in the summer. Um, Yours is, I think, spring. Yes, I love the Or fall. I love the fall because yeah. I love layers. I love leather. Yeah, I, mean, she I love fur. Technically, love she was born boots. in the fall. She was born in the fall. Though. Her birthday's about to come up in, what's today's date? The second. Her birthday's in 16 days. Today's the second, right? Yes. Okay, she, her birthday's in 16 days. Okay. What's one present they'll always be happy to receive? Makeup or jewelry? That's to me. Mm -hmm. I would say sneakers, like any type of Air Maxes or something like that. 
or shoes. Not just Air Maxes, sneakers. Sneakers in general. She loves sneakers. She's a sneakerhead. She has so many sneakers. So if I bought her like a nice pair of sneakers, she'll love it. Yes. And I do like a good designer, you know. Because Risa don't make no designer money. <laughs> so she gonna be getting these designer sneakers. I do like these a good non -designer designer. These non-designer sneakers. Because okay. I don't got none of that type of money. Okay, moving to the next one? Yeah. What is their dream? Oh. What? Did you skip some? Yeah. Where'd you go? I was right here, number 17. No, that's their season. So how did you get the gift? Where'd you get the gift from? Girl, what are you doing? Oh, I just made up my own question. That was, yeah. a, question. That was a bonus question. <laughs> um... Okay, so uh, what were you actually like in high school? Stoner, goody two shoots, athlete. She was a stoner and a bad kid. For 20. <laughs> you don't even, she doesn't even smoke now, though. <laughs> no, she, did you start smoking again? Nah, okay. I didn't start smoking again. Yeah, she was a stoner and I was a. Uh, what was I? I was a bad. No, I wasn't. Yeah, I was bad, but I was like more like, um. Like, um. I was the type of girl that be like cursing the teachers out. I used to curse the teachers out too. Like. Yeah, but you also smoke. I didn't smoke in high school. Oh. So I was like, you smoked every day. I was a rebel. I wasn't. I don't feel like. I, do you think I was a rebel? No. You did what you were supposed to do. I was. I was a different type of bad. Like. Yeah, we were both kind of like bad, but I still kind of like did more so what I was supposed to do. I guess. She would cut shit. Like, um, the next question was, let me go to the next one. Um, do you want to live in the same city as, do they want to live in the same city as you one day? We live in the same city right now, and we probably will continue to stay in the same city. Yeah, I, I probably will, I will say we'll probably be in the same state, because I want to live in a house. But where would you want to move in the same, to what house where? I, I would go, if it, if the opportunity presented itself, I would go upstate. So we would live in the same state. Honestly, I've been thinking about leaving the country, but, you know, we'll see. Just, just make it tropical, if you do. It was going to be Toronto. <laughs> okay, um, I'll read the next one. What was their worst fear as a child? Has it changed? My, um, her worst fear as a child was pigeons. I don't know if it's changed. It's not changed. Um, what was your worst fear? I felt like when we were young, you were never afraid of a shit. I wasn't. I, I probably, I think I just now. No, no, bugs. <laughs> bugs. She's definitely afraid and was always definitely <laughs> afraid of bugs. Specifically flies. I hate flies so much. <laughs> like, it's the sounds like have you guys ever heard of the book um the mosquito that buzzes in your ear mm -hmm. the, that is some type of african folklore type of book yeah, yeah, and yeah. that type that sound that a fly <laughs> makes like when it comes close it like it literally gives me the shivers i hate it um go to number 28 number 28 what is your go-to activity when you are reunited with them we'll probably get some drinks some doinks. I don't like the, the word reunited. We live 30 blocks away. Ooh, we some doinks. Some doinks. Doinks and links. And some hookah, probably. Hookah, hookah. Why is hookah? Yes. <laughs> probably drink some hookah. Drinks and links and hookah. Drink link hookah. We'll probably go we to talk, a movie. We talk, we laugh. We like movies. We. I think we go to the movies together a lot more than like I've ever been to the movies with anyone else. Yeah. Let me see. You just a 28? Yeah. What's their guilty pleasure TV show? I think we have the same guilty, guilty pleasure Ratchet TV, TV. Show. Yes, but specifically, I think that our favorite show together had to be Flavor of Love and I Love Yo. You. Like, that is when if reality that shit TV come was on now, gold. Like, what? If that comes on now, I'm watching it. Mm -hmm. Like, I cannot not watch that show. Yes. How do they like their eggs? We both like scrambled. Scrambled eggs, but she likes some scrambled hard, hard, hard. Cause I don't like. And she doesn't eggs. like cheese in them. Cause she, I don't think she really likes eggs, even though she keeps eating them. I think she just eats them. Cause yeah. Uh, yeah. Um, are they team Bloody Mary or team Mimosa? Mimosa. Mimosa. 
If you guys could take a sibling trip, no parents or other relatives or significant others, where would you go? I think we would disagree because I don't want to go to Dubai. No, I would go there too. We don't disagree. We agree. We agree? We agree. That would be your first choice though? Yes, bitch. To go there to all with no one else. I would want to do it Maybe like a, a French a, trip. Like a girl's trip. But without like parents. No, but just me and you. So me, if it was just me and you. Dubai is fun. Well, see that that. So you wouldn't want to do Dubai just me and you. That's I what would want to do Dubai just me and you, but I feel like because Dubai is like such an expensive place, I feel like the more people that go, the less expensive it would be. If it was just me and you, the I feel like the best trip for um siblings to go on, girl siblings, would to be like Essence Fest. Oh, that's a good idea. That would be lit. I think that's a great idea. Or a cruise, like a, like a, a cruise too. Cruise, like a weekend cruise, where? To like Bahamas. Bahamas, like we would fly to Miami. Oh, I was about to say because <laughs> no, only because your boyfriend don't want to go on a plane. We would fly to Miami mm -hmm. and then get on a cruise to Bahamas, and then that's a cute little like we should do that. No, I don't want to go to the Bahamas. We've been to the Bahamas. I know we've been to the Bahamas, but there's other, I don't think they go other places where we could do like just me and you just go for like a weekend, three days. Well, it can't be somewhere that I want to go to my birthday next year. Where you want to go to your birthday? To Honduras, because I want to go. I'm not to, going on a cruise to Honduras, so I want to go to Honduras because I want to do. I want to go to the. I think it's the French Little Key or something like that, where you can like get in the water with the Jaguars. And the cheetahs, and I you can take pictures with them. They're babies. Are they invited? invited? Why wouldn't you be? Okay then. So then we'll go there next year. Okay. Are you super organized, neat, and fairly laid back, or a complete slob? Complete slob. <laughs> I'm not a slob. <laughs> I am no, a she's creative, messy. free person. I'm a little messy. <laughs> But I'm that was a slob. She's messy though. I am messy. Mm -hmm. I'm not dirty. I'm messy. Like, messy. If I come home, I take my clothes off. I just throw them all. Instead of putting them away like I should. Messy. She's messy. You're messy too. I'm not messy. You're not neat. Yes, I am. I actually have OCD. No, you don't. Why are yes, you diagnosing do. yourself with OCD? I know I have OCD. You don't. Yes, I do. We're going to skip that question. We're going to continue on because somebody's not being totally honest. Anyways. Are they good with technology? Yes. Are they book smart or street smart? I feel like growing up in New York, you got to be a little bit of both. Both. Like, like, we're both. Like, we have to be. And we weren't even, like, in the street. But, like, you know. When you grow up in Harlem... You know, you got yeah, to know yeah, how to gotta defend gotta know. yourself. Yeah. You got to know how to have that mindset to get to the money and, you know. Exactly. So, we're both. We're both smart. And then you have to be educated. Um, yeah. Are they a chocolate person? Yeah, I am. She is. I'm not really. She's more of like gummies and stuff, like Starbursts. Yeah. Like she prefers that kind of candy. I like if I eat candy or eat something sweet, it's usually chocolate. Well, I like chocolate. I like I like Snickers. Yeah, but that's it. Like I will eat chocolate. More I like than peanut chews. <laughs> <laughs> Ew. Peanut chews is fire. Nah, me. You're bugging. All right. Do you prefer dogs or cats? Dogs. dogs. Do you want to live in the city, country, or suburbs of a city? City. You know. But she just said she would move upstate. So yeah, she's like, willing to live in the city. Because I, I want to move in a house. Like, I want to have a you pool a house in, in Queens, my sis. backyard. You get a house in Queens, sis. With a pool? Yes. I don't want one of those pools that you buy at Walmart. No, you can have a whole pool. In what part of Queens? Long Island. <laughs> you can move to Long Island. You know how expensive it is to live in Long Island? Nah, they got hoods in Long Island. Like, they got black parts of Long Island. They do, like, Southampton. Suffolk County. Anyway. <clears throat> <coughs> what did they, or do they currently major in, in college? Mass communications? 
Um, what is your major? Because she's not, she's so undecided. She, no, I decided. What is it? I'm going to do arts and entertainment management. Okay, so, but you said that before, like way back, and then you switched, and then you switched back. Yeah, because, but the only reason why I switched is because I felt like I was getting pressure from mom and dad to do something that was would be considered more of a like a stable, career, yeah, yeah, a stable yeah. career path but like i said i work in a hospital the having that experience you don't like it. it exactly and it really kind of motivated me to go for a career that i'm actually passionate about and mm -hmm. i feel like i'll actually be happy doing that i'd rather do that instead of going to work and be miserable Facts. every day you like that's not that. that's not the wave not the wave were they a teacher's pet at elementary school? No. 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 <laughs> Were, Were they, they obsessed, obsessed with their birthday growing up? Or, or did they not like attend? No. A birthday, it's a celebration. Yeah. Are you ready? Hop up. Hey. <laughs> <laughs> um, on a scale of 1 to 10, how much do they care about social media? I'm going to go with, for me, a 10. Well, no, you're supposed to answer for me. A 10? <laughs> I thought she, she was going to give yourself a low number. That's how I was looking at you. No, like, I, I care. Not, I don't care about what, like, people think or whatever like that. But, like, now that I'm doing, like, especially since I have this platform, like, it really, really matters to me, like, my social media content. Like, now it matters more so than ever. Mm. And then for her, I'm going to say it doesn't matter at all because she doesn't really, like, she don't be on social media. You know, I, I use my social media for the FBI. To snoop. To snoop like what the things you can find out on social media girl girl <laughs> if you're the older sibling does your younger sibling feel like it's always trying to fill your shoes or do they all or have they always known they wanted to be something different um I'm older than her so I guess this question is for me um, I don't, I think when we were younger, like when we was talking about like high school and stuff and middle school, like she decided that she didn't want to go to the same school as me because she felt like the teachers compared you to me or something like that. But other than that, like, no. Yeah, that I was definitely going to say that. I remember, um, when my dad, uh, wanted me to go to her school, they set up like an interview and everything. She they was going to accept, accept you right away. Too. They were going to accept me, but I literally started crying. And the interview, my dad was so mad. He was like, what you need a car for? <laughs> and I was like, because I don't want to go to the same school as Risa. I want to be my own person. Wait, but we're, I, but I think since we don't go to the same school, like, we're totally two different people. Yeah, we are. Like, yeah, so other than that, like, so I guess the answer is was was yes, and now just completely no. Uh, do they love to read, or would they rather spend Friday night catching up on their favorite shows? She's a binge watcher. I but she also read. loves to No, I got uh, you. She loves to read, though. Um, yeah. I'll probably do the same thing, like, both. We're uh, similar in that way. Yeah. When, when they were growing up, were they an introvert or an extrovert? Introvert, extrovert. Are they an introvert or extrovert now? Introvert, extrovert. <laughs> I'm not an introvert. I'm just, um... A bitch. I'm not a bitch. <laughs> I just, like... To She's always talking about how I'm, like, a little Maureen or whatever. Is that not answering the question? I don't know. I, that's a hard question. What is it again? What is something you share with your parents or other siblings that they don't? Oh, but I'm thinking about that as in personality. Probably, I don't know. We can we can go ahead, like, cause I don't know. Next question. Last two questions. What is one thing they wanted to accomplish when they were younger that they have now hit out of the park? Skip like what is <laughs> What are you We're only in our twenties, like Shut up. we got more shit to do. That's a fact. Like What are you most proud of them for? Graduating college. Aw, thanks. Definitely. I'm most I wish you would do it more, but I'm most proud of my sister's voice. I think I'm more proud of my sister's voice than hers <laughs> than she is of herself. <laughs> 
And then she is her of her own voice. That makes sense. Um, so that is the end of our questions. Do you have any other questions you could think about that you would want to ask before we stop it? Um No, I think these were some pretty those good questions. Those are good questions. I like yeah. those. I found those on what is this? I found this on thoughtcatalog.com. I just Googled some shit and was like, 55 questions, and I was like, this seems promising. So I picked that. Yeah, that, those are some cute questions. Yeah. yeah. Um, so that's it. I guess you guys can see we really know each other. Like, we're really sisters. Not pretend sisters. How could we be pretend sisters? Because, you know, some people have, like, weird relationships with their sisters Siblings yeah stuff, they're, they're yeah, not weird. really close yeah, like, like i would say sisters. that we're really like close yeah. close sisters yeah. we're like friends <sighs> after we just told those little secrets yes um we're done okay so I'm gonna close up Okay guys, I want to thank you guys for watching me and my sister act like total goofballs like we always are all right, don't forget to subscribe to my channel, thumbs up this video, and when you subscribe, make sure you hit the bell so that anytime that I post, you know about it. Get those notifications. All right, guys. Bye. What do you call them? Flur flurbies. No. The flurbies? <laughs> Flowers? She doesn't like the flurbies. We're going to let... We're gonna, with, uh, remember Mean Girls? It's not gonna happen! <laughs> it's not gonna, not gonna happen! Stop trying to make fetch happen! It's never gonna happen! Okay, so. Uh -huh. Yes. Bye, guys! Bye! <laughs> Every second, every minute, man, I swear that she can get it. Say if you a bad bitch, put your hands up high.